and as we are about to begin our meeting, may your presence among us, may you give us wisdom without without your presence, Holy Spirit, because we know that all wisdom comes from you. As we read the man's life, not against any spirit, against any spirit that is going to play with our network. And whatever cut we are using right now in the mighty name of Jesus, we cover everyone, all the participants, may all those who are about to join us be satisfied. We ask for this more of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you so much for that wonderful prayer. Uh, at this moment in time, let me just find out whether the SG is in. Madam SG, are you around? Madam SG? I'm present. I'm here. Good morning, everyone. Yes, Good morning, uh, Abel. Thank you. <laughs> okay. right. Let me just give you this opportunity just to just give us a few words uh, remarking uh, your opening remarks then uh, we start our program talk to us okay i hope my network doesn't fail me Madam, um you? thank you am i audible oh, no problem mr kalubasa am i audible yeah very loud and clear with me, very loud and clear. All right, thank I you. I don't know other areas, but I'm um, actually, thank you. All right. Go ahead, Mara. Okay. So thank you, um, and everyone. Thank you so much for coming in a good number. Uh, we really appreciate. Um, Charity Mukonda, the Secretary General for Trikatane, and also be part of the CDT group entirely where Trikatan is the organization that helps the vulnerable and the needy in our society and communities. Very grateful to see a lot of people that others have met in person and uh, others are meeting for the first time. Would like to come to an understanding between uh, us and everyone present to say, as Trikatane, we are here for you. We are here to serve and make sure that the needy and vulnerable in our society are not left out. And so everything that you do here, we ask that you do with empathy, knowing that what you are going to do will impact our communities and societies um, across the globe. As we are doing this, we have touched not only Zambia, but other countries as well. So I would like you to be at your best because at the end of the day, you are impacting more than just yourself, more than just your home, but at the end of it all, everything that you do here, will have a greater impact on the economy of your country and where you're coming from. We're here to support your vision. And so we are welcoming you to this orientation, UFC orientation, where we orient you before you get to your courses, various courses. So we are grateful that you are here and, um, and that you have um, accepted our help in hand as we go through this journey together. I will come you all and, and I pray that our Lord Jesus himself guides us through the Holy Spirit that wherever uh, we need guidance and uh, direction we are in the right track and we align with God's purpose. Uh, Tikatane is uh, founded on the word of God and operations therein so we acknowledge God in everything that we do for we are dealing with not just hearts and people around but with souls that the Lord himself has rendered to us. So thank you, and uh, you're welcome all. God bless. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, SG. Uh, uh, at this moment, let me go upon uh, our HOD, Mr. 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 Sinkoli, can you 
to, oh, before we actually go with that, let me just uh, call upon all the teachers, the lecturers that are present here to tell us what we're going to do is uh, put on your video, introduce yourself, where you are based, the course you're going to take, then uh, when you are through, you can switch off the video and even on the voicemail. Thank you so much. So we we'll go in that order. The teachers, please, can we introduce ourselves? Teachers, are we here? Lecturers, are we here? Yes, we are here. Yes, can we just introduce ourselves so that our learners can know us properly? What? Yeah. Okay, good morning, everyone. Good morning, madam. Can you switch on your video as well? We lost her. Madam, have you lost you? We are able to get you. Go ahead. Good morning. Good morning. Put on your video so that we are able to see you, madam. Okay, my video is on. I'm not able to see you. Maybe oh, it's yeah. the network. Yeah. Okay, now you are able to. I'm able to see you. Okay, go ahead now. Okay, so good morning, everyone. I am Nina and I am a biology and chemistry teacher. I am based in Kitwe. Okay. Madam, you said you are your name? No, okay. I am Miss Miss Nimbiri Taonga. Okay, thank you so much. So I'll be taking yeah. in biology and chemistry, and I reside in Kitwe. Thank you so much. Let's have another one. Switch off your video. Let another one come in. Okay, I am also. So can she also introduce herself by using one phone? Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. Good morning, Sam. Morning, morning. You are addressing the others, not me. <laughs> Get everyone on the, on the forum. Please. Good morning, everyone. We want to know you. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, Good morning, good. madam. OK. OK. Go ahead. OK. Um, Nimbili Belita. I'll be teaching mathematics. I reside in Kitwe. Thank you, madam, we've gotten you. Okay.
Next, next. Morning, everyone. Morning. My name is Asinche Chaino. I live in Solwezi and I'll be taking you in mathematics. Thank you, madam. All right. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, madam. Good morning. Good morning. Um, morning, morning. Go ahead. I'm Sarah Mashasha, based in Tafue. We'll be offering English and entrepreneurship. Thank you. What's the name again? Sarah Mashasha. What's the name? Mashasha Sarah. Yeah, we're getting you. This have another one. Are we through? Go ahead. Good morning, everyone. Go ahead. Good morning. My name is Toby Kumbwa. I'm based in Kasiwe, and I'll be offering research, special education, and English. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. I'm Miss Glenn. I'm Miss Bulendo Mwamba. I reside in Luansha and I'll be offering chemistry and biology. Okay, thank you so much um, uh, to all the teachers that have come through. Yes, I'd like to yes. give to um, our CEO, I need to be forgiven. I, I see it's present. So you can come through. Am I visible, Madam Casey? Hello? Yes, sir, you are. A little bit. Oh, what about, is my camera there? Yeah. Yes, yeah. I found a bit from the mic. Although okay, it's I'm a little bit blurred, but. Uh... Oh, okay. All, all right. Yeah, good morning, uh, uh, Mr. Director Kaluba, Education. Good morning, Madam SD. Good morning, uh, Mr. Pani. Good morning, Mr. Mike. Here, the students, I've just seen some students that need to say, we just hear the teachers talking. We are not talking. Say, no, no, no. <laughs> you are being oriented so as teachers i'm doing as a teacher as teachers we have to introduce yourself because you know we're going to be teaching you so i just want to introduce myself as a teacher i'm even through Kumana. i want to be coming through as german language one of the german language teachers we've got quite a number of them and also i'm going to be a standing or assistant teacher in chemistry and physics where Probably one teacher is not available, other teachers are not available. As long as I have this one degree of time, I'm going to be jumping in as in these uh, modules, physics, and chemistry. Thank you. 
so much and God bless you all. Thank you, sir. Next, please. Thank you so much. Um, what we can do is that we can set all our mics on mute until uh, we are called upon. And then for network clarity, if you can switch off your video, you are actually more clear on the audio side when you're uh, when you're given an opportunity to speak. So you can, uh, when you're given, you switch on your video, we see you, then you do the audio because there you control the network variance. It will be easy for you to, for us to get you after we see you. Just a caution, thank you. Thank you so much. Next one, please come in, switch on your video, introduce yourself when you are through, switch off the video and mute yourself. Thank you. Next one. Good morning, everyone. Morning. My name is uh, Stephen Chimudi, based in Kitwe. I'll be teaching mathematics and chemistry. Mr. Kalubab, have you gotten me? No, then here. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Next. Good morning, sir. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, morning. Okay. Um, are you able to get me? Loud and clear. Okay, thank you. Uh, ahead, my name is uh, Moses Zubu. Okay, my name is Moses Zuru. I'm based in uh, Lusaka. I will be teaching biology and uh, sociology. Thank you. Thank you. Next. We are through. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, sir. Uh, my name is Dan Kunda. We take biology, mathematics, and psychology. Thank you. Biology and what? I didn't pick you clearly, Mr. Kunda. I was saying my name, my name is Dan Kunda. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yeah, where are you based? I'm based in Rwanda. Thank you so much, thank you. Thank you, 
Let's have another one, please. Let's have another one. Yes, go ahead, madam. Go ahead. Madam, go ahead. I'm not able to pick you up. Hello, Madam Skapanda. Can you hear me now? I'm not able to speak anything. anything can we have can we have someone else she can come in later madam skapanda can come in later can we have someone else Let's have um, Kaunda Chibwe. Kaunda Chibwe, can you come in? Is it Miss, Mr. Kaunda Chibwe? Are you a teacher? Teachers, lectures, please, can you can we finish up this program and actually go to the other item? We are running out of time. Hello, good morning. I, I introduced myself earlier. Hello. 
Hello, we are getting you. Yes, I'm saying I introduced myself earlier. Where are you? Toby Kumba. Um, I think the name is. Uh, Hello. Oh, okay. I introduced myself earlier. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Let's have another one. Those who haven't yet introduced themselves, can you come in, please? Morning, morning, you are faint a bit louder. Yes, I'm getting you, but you are faint. You are faint. Can you speak a little bit louder? Go ahead. Go ahead. Yes, good morning, sir. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Uh, this is Lungu Taita. Go ahead. So I reside in Kibwe, and I'm one of the teachers. Okay. 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 Uh, due to lack of time, I think you continue with this exercise as we go on. But at this moment in time, let me now bring in HOD, Mr. Sincodi, to please take the floor. Mr. Sincodi, you are welcome. Thank you. Hello, hello. Good, good morning, everyone. Hello. Good morning, sir. I hope morning, I'm clear. Good morning. Okay, thank you. Okay, I hope I'm good morning. I hope clear and loud to everyone, at least and every member that is in this meeting. Uh, first of all, I may have this opportunity to introduce myself. Um, I am Sinkoli Makai. Um, I am the deputy uh, uh, HOD, National Director, University Foundation course. I am under the boots of uh, Mr. Sowera, who is uh, the director for this faculty. May I take this rare opportunity also to be the presence of uh, the HQ, uh, the, the, the Chief Executive Officer, Mr. Komana, through the SG, Madam. Charity Mponda, I believe they're in the meeting, and also recognize the presence of Mr. Kaluva, the Education Director, Zambia. Thank you so much, and everyone who is in the meeting, ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you to this meeting officially. Uh, uh, this meeting is meant to get each other acquainted in this faculty, the University Foundation course, so that we begin to know who is who has. Uh, has it been, ha been happening uh, the way the, the director, Mr. Kalova, has directed that we are introducing each other because we need to know each other as we venture to start this program. I'd like to say thank you and welcome you and say I'm glad that you've been so patient all this while up to this time, which is a milestone that we have achieved. We have achieved this so that we can serve Twikatani and the CDT group together in serving the vulnerable and the need in our community. Uh, we are so delighted that we, as members of staff and students, we've, we've been patient to wait until a good news came that on the 29th of this month, the physical classes and the online are beginning, but are starting. But before they start as lecturers and students, we need to know each other and what happens in this uh, faculty. Uh, let me have uh, just a few things to say uh, to my colleagues. Uh, fellow teachers, fellow lecturers that are going to offering our services to our beloved students. Uh, one of the things that uh, we, I would say is that 80% of the work behind uh, the scenes has been done. 
and you, we've seen uh, the, the, the schedule and the appointments and different um, courses that will be taken to teach uh, our students. But uh, above all, we are going to look at uh, how we are going to operate as uh, lecturers and uh, cementing on the relationship with our student. One of them is creating such a platform where our students and our lecturers will come together and interact. So this meeting is an interactive meeting where we are going to talk and be able to hear our views. One of the things that is important in every faculty is a channel of communication, more especially on the part of our lecturers, even students, because uh, we both have, uh, we need to cement our relationship between the students and the lecturers so that at the end of it all, we have to meet the objective the objectives of our faculty, our faculty and make sure that whatever we intend to do flourishes and happen in the manner that we want it to happen. Because mind you, our objective is to save the need and the vulnerable. Our relationship is important as students and lecturers. It's one of the most key uh, lifeblood that can drive our faculty, our, fac our faculty in the right direction. Would want to have a present relationship between these uh, two parties, the students and the lecturers. I believe at this time, uh, each and everyone is ready and prepared for uh, the activity that is commencing on the 29th of uh, this month, of which I would say our culture, our work culture should be that one which is favorable that will accommodate even the students and also us, the lecturers. And uh, uh, on the part of the student, I would also emphasize on the aspect of attendance, uh, which is very cardinal, because for us to achieve uh, what we intend to do in this faculty, attendance is important. Now, the, the university foundation course uh, is one that prepares a student for further studies to, uh, to pursue a specific career. We, we as CDT, we have two, um, we have different schools. One of the major ones, one of the majors and two or major schools of, uh, we have is the School of Natural Sciences. We have a School of Humanities and also School of Business where we have Social Sciences and other uh, courses. But now, under the Investor Foundation courses, we'll be trying to prepare what we call in Zambia, the A-levels, a preparatory uh, stage to a further uh, pace, uh, program that we'd want to specialize in after a year of undergoing this curriculum or this course of uh, study. Our lecturers and each and every member of staff, we are all ready because we have received and prepared for 29 for us to start. Now, this uh, pr uh, faculty is going to look at it. We are going to look at things to make sure that this program is implemented and everything is ready. To the student, as your lecturers and the members of staff, we are ready to save you at all times and we are prepared for you. I hope even to our students, you are also prepared to attend the, uh, the courses and we really want to see your commitment so that at the end of it all, we produce the best students that are going to present us in German. And mind you, as students, there are benefits of being, there are be uh, benefits that are attached to this program that I, uh, that I would love to tell you, say the best student who have an opportunity to start to pursue their further specialization when they go to, uh, to Germany and other European countries. That is how beautiful beautiful CDT is. And this is what we are bringing to you. Uh, I believe uh, uh, having said what I've said, I've just emphasized on the relationship and also we are, uh, the commitment on the part of students and also the attendance, your seriousness. And I've also talked about the channel of communication that should be very important within our, our faculty. Any issue from the student, I think there will be specific, uh, you'll be, uh, it will be sent to be told the specific uh, lectures you can talk to, the immediate lecturers or the immediate people in the management that you can you talk to so that we follow the right channel of communication of any grievance, uh, either coming from the student, even among us lecturers, because it's very important in any faculty to have a better flow of information. The other thing is uh, that I mentioned was the relationship. The relationship is important between us and the student because without that, we will not work well. So I emphasize that as we commence this program on the 29th of um, August, 
I would like that we, 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 we have that cordial relationship. We can be brothers keepers or we can take care of each other in a manner that at the end of it all, no one infringes each other's uh, right or, or human rights. So that at the end of all, they feel infringed because of uh, certain circumstances. But I would urge in this meeting that as uh, parties involved in this faculty, I would ask that we, we, we become professional, we become considerate, we also come, become people that are objective so that at the end of it all, we serve each other as needs. As Africa Tani is not any an ordinary uh, organization, it's an organization or it's a part, the, the faculty is, a, it, 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 we want to make it a, a, a faculty that each and every part has to benefit with mutual respect. We, if this is not the, a faculty for a pupil teacher relationship, but this one is a lecturer student relationship where people know what they are in, into. Why you are under this faculty, you understand why you are a student, you understand why we are a lecturer. We don't need to begin to remind one another of the things that we are supposed to do. We, we need to do them accordingly and professionally so that at the end of it, all, all parts is benefit and all our needs and objectives and personal needs and organizational needs are met. Having said all these key aspects, I want to say to the lecturers, if at all, oh, I believe everything is prepared and we are ready, more especially all the syllabi and uh, the courses that we are taking, each and every lecturer knows because they were sent way back. So we are prepared and ready for this program to start and to commence. Thank you so much. I, uh, I bring it, take it back to Ms. the director, Mr. Kalova, if there's anything that which must be said, that is what I can say. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Head of HOD. Thank you for the words and the encouragement to our learners and the members of staff. At this moment in time, maybe let me just allude to what you've just talked to. I've picked one or two items from the speech you have just given. I think uh, he's talked about the emphasis of channel of communication, very important in any organization. Be it be a church, be it be a home, be it be at school, communication is very important. We need to know how to communicate. We need to know who to go to, and we need to know how feedback is supposed to be brought back to where the source of communication started from, very important. Two, we know that every teacher, every lecturer, every student, who had applied to this organization had received a contract of understanding, memorandum of understanding or a contract. This contract carries a few statements, rules and regulations of the organization, which emphasizes that uh, everyone who had received that contract is supposed to abide by the rules which are stipulated on that paper. The day you received that paper, meant that you are part and parcel of the organization. And as such, you are expected to behave accordingly in a normal manner. Failure to which disciplinary action shall be instituted to those who are found wanting. So we should really be up to ourselves that we see how best we can accommodate each other. Let's be tolerant to one another. Let's not just start talking up and down like no man's business. Let's see how best we can behave ourselves. We are adults here. We need to know how we're going. Because what we're doing here is to assist the renal, the vulnerables, so that they can have a good living in our society. We want to uplift their standard of living so that we help them stand on their own. OK? So at the moment, let me find out whether SG has got something. Madam SG? If there's nothing, 
Madam SG? Okay, maybe she can come in a little yes, bit later. Sir. Let me talk about uh, some courses, okay? CDT courses which are being offered under UFC. We've got a, a few courses which have been lined up at the moment, looking at what each student or each learner had applied for. The courses which have been of major concern to us that uh, these are the courses we can start with. They are very, very few, but not more than 20. And some of them are, one, mechanical engineering, two, electrical engineering, three, electronics, electrical and uh, auto engineering, agricultural uh, engineering. Then there's medicine. Then there's business administration, business management, environmental sciences, economics, nursing, computer sciences, software engineering, information technology, education, others have gone into food and nutrition management. Those are the courses which we have identified that we can start with. Although these courses will start in the second year of your running when you finish up with uh, our UFC program, which is an A-level program. You need to satisfy us that you clear the A-levels, then you can go into your second year, which we shall call as first year in the university. But in Zambia, this is the second year. So you need to finish up with the early levels before you actually start your full-time course program, which will start when you are through with it. this after the 12 months, which we shall run from September till August next year. Although there will be time when you break off, I think after six months you break off, then you continue the last phase. We shall have two semesters to finish up this program, the UFC. The first semester shall carry about six, six months, then the last one, another six months. Then we are done with the 12 months program of UFC. It's from there that now we shall pick those who will be going to do the actual courses. These people are going to be placed in the institutions in the country. And those who, who are very, very she will find themselves outside to go and continue their program with the CHU University in the German. So I wish all the students to do their best so that we see how best we can help you. Thank you so much on this note. I will maybe ask the SG to come in. Madam SG, are you around? Yes, sir. Any last comments, madam? Um, right now, I would just like to thank everyone uh, present we, uh, and also... Okay, as every... I just want to ensure that every teacher has come through and they have introduced themselves because this is where we'll get the rock off from, as you all have noted. The, 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 the whole meeting is being recorded. So I want to ensure that every teacher has been presented. And for those that are not around that you know of. Then, uh... Because we had stopped the introduction of teachers, then we we'll continue from there so that they participate in introducing themselves at the later day. So maybe after you commented, you come and yes, if you the last comment. Can you maybe continue with the yeah. teacher's uh, introductions? That's that is okay. Then okay, okay. Then thank you so much. I'll call you later. Maybe can you can just give the chance to the teachers to finish up the introductions. Mm -hmm.
uh, right. the teachers, can we finish up where we had stopped? We've got um, Mr. Chancellor Pambwe. Are you there? Mr. Jimmy Mgala. Mr. Joseph Kunda. I'm looking at the list of teachers who are present on my list. Madam Regina Msonda, present. Madam Nkumbwa Silvia, are you around? Mr. Lungu Titus, are you around? Present. This one, I don't know whether she's female or male. It says Chishimba Mbani. Now I don't know whether it's male or female. Yes, Mr. Lungu, can you go ahead? Mr. Lungu, go ahead. You are very faint, sir. Go ahead. Hello? Yeah, I'm getting you. Okay, I said the new title to be an psychology, psychology, then I can take a few. Next one. We've got Lia uh, Pamlinga. Madam Lia Pamlinga, are you around? Madam Lia Pamlinga? Hello. Okay. Um, are we making progress? I think uh, all the teachers, uh, those who are present here, I think they've already introduced themselves. Maybe let me talk about uh, one or two items for actually to bring in any other business. Okay, let me just... Uh, let me I talk think... about the centers. Okay. Hello, sir. The centers which we've... Uh, identified and have confirmed that our teacher, our learners will go to. We've got uh, in Kitwe, oh, the, the devs has got to give a final word by today or tomorrow. In Kitwe, there are centers which we shall, shall confirm by the end of the week and we shall post on the platform. This is Muzakiri High School. Chimwemwe High School has already confirmed the center already at Chimwemwe High School. Then we are waiting for Bulangililo Secondary School. We are waiting for Ipskilo Primary School. We are waiting for Mitanto Secondary School. We are waiting for Kakolo Secondary School. Waiting for SOS High School. 
We are waiting for Mama Monti Secondary School. We are waiting for Lulamba Secondary School. We are waiting for Kanfisa Secondary School and Mwekera to confirm, maybe by today or tomorrow. But we'll give an update on this starting from Wednesday. That is under key twin. Okay. In Solwezi, Solwezi, we've got uh, Chawama High School, Chamunda Skills and Trade, Trade School, Community School, something like that. Then uh, Solwezi Technical School wasn't yet uh, confirmed, so tech, but we are still in talks with them. Although they were saying they are just fully booked, but uh, however, we are still trying to talk to them. Those are the three places. And uh, we shall talk to uh, a trade school in Solwezi. We shall confirm that one also on the platform. In Lusaka, we've got Rivala High School. Rivala High School has confirmed as a center. And then uh, last summer, if we've got students there, we've got Northern College of Education. In Mansa, we've got Mansa Trades School. In Choma, we've got Refresh, uh, Refreshing Ministry International Center. That's where we shall be using our uh, programs. Then we've got Monze Manyungu Secondary School. That's the place we shall be using. In Mpongwe, we've got Mpongwe B Basic School. Then we've got Mpongwe Basic uh, Day School. Just a minute, just a minute. Let me take this. Okay, so I'm going to just do a brief orientation on the UFC. I know you've got the, the scoop of what is happening under the UFC, the University Foundation course, undergraduate study. This is meant for those who, who possess the all level, ordinary level, but could not further study in Zambia due to lack of fees. So we are expecting that our students in this course of, of the all levels that are needed. And then we are furthering uh, because of course, as we are our target groups are the needy and the vulnerable, we are expecting that you are not, you are, we, are, we are chipping in on the issue of fees. And then the UFC in the following streams lead to a specialized bachelor's course in medicine, engineering, business administration, computing. So the next are the streams. So we have science and technology stream, STS, mathematics, physics, chemistry, biology, information technology, German. We have business and humanity streams, BHS, general English, psychology, sociology, economics, business studies, information technology, German. So your study progression is as follows. Upon attaining the UFC certificate, the learners continue to specialize bachelor's degree uh, locally at Central Hamburg University, um, Zambia branch. So what we have done is that we have partnered with other universities to make sure that you are getting what you need, even though you are not necessarily in Central, in Hamburg, in Germany from here. On a branch from here, will pick it up. Uh, or may opt to join another local state or an international university. But as long as you have this certificate, we are on to the next program. Okay, selected UFC best students. Best students, I repeat, at the end of the 12 months, you can you are able to win scholarship based on your performance scholarships from Chikatane to go and further studies in Germany at any state university that offer tuition fees, bachelor's degree, according to your course. 
I don't know if I'm audible enough, but it uh, goes down to that. So we get up where you perform well as a, as, as under our Chikachane, you perform well as best, you come out as best student, we pick you up and then we take you to any university that is offering your course if you, if you can under us uh, in Germany. So your performance as we go in the UFC course means much more than you would estimate as a student. It takes you to the next level or we get you to local. For, of course, we, we, are top, we are getting those that will perform well. So those that will be otherwise will be channeled into the right direction where you will get your degree course, wherever it is that you uh, will locate you in, in this country regarding our branch, which we have. We are not leaving you to the scorching sun. We know we are getting you from your all levels. Then we'll put you in the streams. Then from there, we pick it up. At the end of the day, your comfort even after uh, dealing with Twikatane matters to us. So for all those that are under this course, that is your expectation and we expect it to be in accordance. I hope the streams are clear. If there's need to be, we can um, have the brochure, the Trikatane brochure um, posted in all the groups so that we are all on the same page. At the end of the day, why we are here is to orient ourselves, uh, get acquainted with who you are going to be dealing with and whom you are going to be found with. What courses are you taking? Where are we heading? What is it that you are doing? You cannot just say, I'm in a class, I'm, in, I'm doing an online study, but you have no full knowledge about what is happening. So we expect you to be in the know-how of what is happening. I hope I'm audible. Am I clear? Loud and clear. All right. So on practicals at UFC, they do alternative to practical theory, but labs start at second year. Labs, I repeat, start at second year. So second year is where you expect yourself to be practical. So I beg to be understood by all that need. And if uh, there's any more uh, info that you need, the right people are here. At the end of the day, for those that are asking over the issue of dress codes, you, um, is this coming? Okay, we have Ben Kapoko. Oh, okay. This is uh, Believe in Sako. Dress code. Are you a student? Are you uh, a teacher? May I know? I've got questions here. Yeah. Believe in Sako is a student. student. Oh, okay, okay. Yes, he's a student. So you are supposed to dress modest. At the end of the day, you are representing where you're coming from. If I find you dressed inappropriate, I will see, okay, then this is the best representation that Believe can have for us from where they are coming from. Henceforth, please dress modest. We are, we are in acknowledgement of the fact that we are all here to obtain one goal and that is to enrich ourselves with the knowledge that we are being offered right now. So from there, I'll leave it to the director, Mr. Kaluba. You can pick it up. Otherwise, uh, you're all welcome and shalom to all. Thank you so much, madam. Thank you so much. Uh, let me just uh, talk about the last item of the on the centers, which I've confirmed. Uh, the last one, I think, is uh, in Kasama, we've got the uh, Northern College of Education. Then in, in Pika, we've got the Musakanya Basic School. So those are some of our places which are going to make use of our programs, which shall be accommodated in those centers. Then as we go on, 
We shall also try to find more centers so that we accommodate each and every person who had applied to come and be, be part of this program. Thank you so much on that one. Unless there's any other business, I would maybe want a, a few people to just ask a few questions before we actually wind up. Any other business? Be it be from the students, be it be from the lecturers or from the teachers, one of it. I'm giving you time. Any other business? Unmute yourself and come in and ask a question. Sir, I have a question. Go ahead, go ahead. Hello. Yes, sir, is it everyone supposed to go be ahead. attending oh. the physical class? Hello, sir. Are you getting me? Can I can I come to please? Yes. Yes. Um yes. are those are those Wait. teachers coming to I believe we have something coming ahead of today. Is it Mr. Kaluba? Yes, yes, we will need to talk to the teachers uh, uh, at a different time concerning this late program. Here it was just an orientation meeting the students and whatever. But we've got a program for the teachers uh, maybe in the evening. Okay, okay. So picking it up from there, teachers, you'll be allowed to have your question and answers given out in the next uh, session. And uh, when I can bring it out in the sense that so when when parents are speaking or are in a in a talk, usually the children are given time out. So at the moment, as the heads of uh, the program, we'll have all the questions and answers not here. I I don't know if Steve Nambi is um is a student or a teacher, but if you are a teacher, we'll have another time for questions. Thank you very much. I believe I will take up uh, quite. Uh, Adam a Steve Nambi is a, 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 a student. Students want oh, to okay. ask. Steve can come to you. Okay, Madam, I'm Steve Nambi. Yes. Okay. okay. Maybe before actually coming, Mr. Nambi, let's have a, is it Mary? Oh, you've not heard about the same. I've not been given. The one who was there before you. Sir, I'm Mary. here. I have a question. I'm Mary. Mary Chiseni. Mary Chiseni. She's the one who came first. Yes, sir. Okay, I was ahead, asking Mr. Nambi. I was asking about the physical classes. Uh, those uh, were supposed uh, to work. Uh, yes. Uh, uh, the physical classes the were only. <laughs> Hello? Yeah, go ahead. So, are the physical classes only for those who search for German exams, or the physical classes are for everyone for as long as you are applied under your Katani organization? Physical classes are for everyone who applied to the program. Okay, if sir, you thank you. that, that you want to be part and parcel of the classes, you are there, you are invited. German language you will find you there. If you missed the German language a few months ago, two, three months ago, still the classes are still on for the German language uh, A1 program. You will continue that program, OK? When that Thank you will be given a, a timetable when to attend this language. Thank you so much. Thank Mr. you, sir. Sen, Mr. Nambi, Gami. OK. Yeah, Steve, yeah. Thank you, sir. Uh, I think. Uh, uh, we are not yet clear about the center for you know northwestern province so always in particular and the teachers according to me i just heard about one teacher who is uh, in, you know in mathematics you know stream so i don't know how we are going to have a clear picture about our center and the, and the lecturers that we are going to have i think if you can try to shed more lights i think really appreciate it thank you Okay, Mr. Nambi, i think you thank you so much mr Nambi, in fact if you heard me i started first with Solways. Right? I said in Solwezi, we've got uh, three centers. Chawama okay. High School. And okay. Chawama High School in Chawama. Okay? Then we've got uh, yes, Chamunta Skills Center. 
Then I talked about the yeah. uh, SOTEC. I said the SOTEC hasn't yet come straight. We are still talking to the admin at the SOTEC. We'll be able to confirm okay. that place at the later date. That's what I said. On the part of the Thank teacher, you. yes, there's Madam, Madam, just forgot my name. She's there for maths, Chilombo. Okay. There are others who will be there, maybe online, because we haven't yet placed them. Some people are working on those modalities of placing teachers in different localities. So at the moment, I'm not in a position to give you exactly which other teacher or the biology teacher or chemistry teacher will be there in Sorezi. It's our program. We'll know them later. Before the end of the okay. week here, you'll be able to know that they, these are the teachers who will be in these classes. These are teachers who take over these courses. Thank you so much. Coming Thank down. you, sir. And maybe uh, before, sir, before we leave any stone and tent, uh, what about the issue of the IDs? Because mm. uh, until now, mm. uh, you know, we, we, yes, we are pride, but we have mm. not yet received our IDs. Are we going to be allowed to enter classes? Mm. For so is the there, issue of uh, IDs, uh, uh, Mr. Okay, um, uh, let's, let me... Information I got from... Mm. Okay, so right. what it is is that you cannot necessarily have every, every course lecture or teacher, uh, depending on how you're referring to them, in one district. Like we cannot have mathematics, biology, and all these courses in one district. So if your district happens to have maybe one, two or even five according you can get to physically get to the class and uh, hear that lecture or if that person that, that teacher is not in your in your vicinity if you are as the physical class is going on maybe it's a solwezi for example mr Nambi. i'll say solwezi we are doing a physical class of uh, biology and um uh, okay we're doing biology so everywhere else that they need to get biology, they are all not in Solwezi. So the one who is in Solwezi will be streamlined, like they'll be live. So once they are live, everyone else that needs to get from other provinces, that biology lecture should be able to get via online because they cannot be physically there. So the same will go for, for, for Solwezi. If Solwezi is there, we do not have someone physically there on the physical uh, premise to teach maths, you'll be able to get the math via online. That's why we say our class, our our lectures are online and physical classes because of that reason. Until we are able to put people who are able to facilitate those lectures in one place at the same time, like where you can go physically get your class for every course and every subject, then. But before that, we'll be able to catch other subjects and courses online, where you can learn by online and the others that you can manage in the very um, districts or provinces according. Thank you. Okay, uh, Madam, so according to the way you have said it, so for example, as we are, for example, I'm doing engineering, and that is uh, my main electives is mathematics and physics. So, for example, if the teacher for physics is not within, so I have to attend online. And if the one for mathematics is within, then I have to go physical. Yes. Depending if, on how you um, would, you um, will prefer, it is go physical there, or maybe you shall be in online. classes. You shall you shall be in classes, but online. Okay. For example, we've got uh, Madam Chilobo, who is uh, taking math. Mathematics. The day of chemistry, you all be assembled, you all be assembled at, for example, at Chawama Basin. All right, you'll be there in class, but the person who'll be teaching will be maybe it's Mr. The head of the department, Mr. Sinkori, who is based in Kafu. He will be teaching chemistry. Thank you very much, sir. In Kafu, maybe in a class in Kafu. Then you'll be in Sorozi at Chawama Basin, but online. Okay, you get me that. Yes, sir. Okay, so uh -huh. you, that's the arrangement, which is there. But for mathematics, people, you physically, the teacher will be there. Okay. Yes. Um, 
I, I know everyone wants to speak, but looking at time. So what you do is that uh, type your question. I can see others are coming up with questions. You are even more articulate when you type your question so that you can just read it out and answer it. Otherwise, for, for where we raise our hands, like it will take forever. So at the moment, I can see uh, why is Lusaka only have one center. We cannot have too many centers when people have applied in one uh, province and not like in one district are not enough for maybe three centers. We are going with the number of students. We cannot have more than Libala. Libala is enough for the ones that have applied in Lusaka. That's why we have one center in Lusaka. On the ID cards, the ID cards are done. It's just a matter of distribution on who's where and how they will reach. Uh, what uh, time you will be learning in the centers, the time you'll be communicated, Mr. Ben Kapopo, uh, Kapoko, yes, you'll be communicated to at when the, the, the lectures will start, what time you're at the centers, and what is expected of you. Is it one cost to another? That can be uh, discussed with the director, Mr. Kaluba. You can, you can go through his office. Where all the centers were announced. If you did not hear, please ask from within. We are working with time. And then, um, oh, okay, madam, is it everyone who is supposed to be attending physical classes or only those who sat for the German exam? So, according to your course, because you cannot say you did, you, you are doing German language or you're doing a different course from that one, you say, I am I attending physical classes? It all depends on you because we are offering both physical and online. When a physical class is going on, it's also online. So, it depends on you. And then the other thing that, uh, especially with those that are coming in after the theories and then we are into skills, those have to be attending the skills, obviously the practicals. So there's a time when you can do it online and uh, go on the physical class. And also importantly, that you'll be present on the time that you're doing practicals. Okay, so for other questions, Okay, please touch also about the time of learning in these centers and it is also distance offered. Okay, the distance will come through because you are doing distance where you come through online. So regardless of where you are, you can still catch up. There are also recordings are posted. Um, once a lesson is done, if you if you are not able to attend that day, we are, just like the way this meeting is recorded, we record lessons as well. So that should be a thing of oh, no worry at all. Dress code, we talked about it. You dress modest everywhere, whether you're going to be on, when you're online as a teacher, of course, teachers know how they're supposed to dress. Students, please dress modest because these recordings will go beyond uh, the corners of your rooms, the corners of your, your arrangement. Uh, even where you are, be mindful of the environment that you are attending a class from. Is it your bedroom? Is it uh, what's the background? Are you in a sitting room? I, do you have noise in the background? All those things are supposed to be noted. Your environment is supposed to sound like mine. Ready to hear the next person speaking and I'm audible because my environment supports what I'm doing. It's online, yes, but you have to have on a concern. Your conscience has to be awakened to the environment that you are doing all this at. So for all those um, that joined late and uh, introductions, introductions were done. And then the good part is that since this is an orientation, it will be posted and then you can catch up. So Lusaka, it is Libala. So all those that want centers for Lusaka, it is Libala. So, okay. So I think there's not many questions thereafter. Time to report. Are we, it's, uh, Steve, time to report where? Where are we reporting from? Uh, Mr. Kalua will, ca will go through again with the centers. They are asking if we have Kalulushi district. Do we have any center in Kalulushi district? If you are told we are not able to capture a district in, because in maybe Kalulushi. we don't have. So, Steve, I said centers, when reporting on the centers, we report according to what we have been posted. There will be a post to say we are meeting at such a time, uh, this center, or maybe we are. 
um, we are catching our, our online studies at such a time. That time you're supposed to either be at your center. If you don't have maybe a gadget, you need someone to help you with the gadget, or maybe you are somewhere where you are not reach, you cannot reach. It depends, but the time will be communicated. How about centers in Indola? Uh, the centers and the physical classes are based on how many students we have in a particular area. We cannot have, uh, say, a center in, uh, um, in Pika when there's no student here. We can have it, yes, but at the end of the day, we cannot necessarily have it active for one student who can catch it online. So like here in Pika, Right now, we have no recordings of students, but we, our center is readily available for those that would like to come through. So when it comes to live streaming for those doing physical classes at different centers, we all get to actually hear. We are at this, you are at the center, what do you want? You want to help with a gadget or you can get it online, you, are, you communicate. From there, you can pick it up. Do we have teachers in Northern part of Kasama? We have teachers, we have Mr. Diana there and other lectures. So at the end of the day, um, you just need to be acquainted with the area that you are in. And then uh, the lectures, and then um, once you get acquainted with the, with the area where you are, you'll find out who is at the centers whom you can contact. Kasama has been, um, uh, uh, Kasama has been active and we have students there. Uh, we have students that actually got, uh, also on the, came for the inauguration. So that means Kasama has been active. So teachers there. So gadgets will be provided for those with no gadgets to stream live, streamline then. Okay, so the thing is that our initial plan of everything it's at the end of the day, the demand that has caused us to be in a haste to start, the demand is very high, but our vision is to have gadgets that will help you at your centers. So if you can have someone, uh, maybe a teacher is at your center, you can use the gadget for those that cannot uh, uh, afford to have one. Or if you have someone that you know that is with us, please uh, get to their gadget and share uh, and care for another because at the end of the day, when we're able to get these gadgets, we'll be able to beam them in those classes. So as soon as we have those gadgets, for the meantime, you have to care and share for the next vulnerable and needy amongst yourselves. No more extra questions. I'm not seeing any new questions. I hope I've managed to answer most. Mr. Kalua, you can take it up and just help us with the issue of centers. Just go through the centers again. Please pay attention. We'll not be going through the centers again. Thank you very right. much. Let me talk about the centers which are already confirmed and we can be there even today. Right? I'll start with Kalulushi. Kalulushi, we've got Mitobo High School. Then we've got Med Trust Academy. These centers have already confirmed. We are just waiting for one more center to be confirmed, which is the Kalurushi High School. But at the moment, two Mitoro High School and the Medi Trust Academy. I'll jump off key, but then let me come to Luansha. Luansha and the Mpongwe District, okay? We've got Mpongwe Basic School. Then we've got Mpongwe Day School. The other centers are yet to confirm, okay? Like Luansha Trades and the, the other institutions in that side. Then we've got uh, another center, which is uh, called Mutende, something like that, Mutende. We'll be able to confirm, we'll be able to give you a, a, a clear direction on that one because that center has already been secured. I've just forgotten the name. It should be Mutende, something like that. That will be also our center in Mpongwe. Then we've got Solwezi. Solwezi, we've got Chawama High School and Chamunta Community School. Plus there's another trade school that side, Trade Skills Training Center. That's it, what it's called. Trade Skills Training Center. That is in Solwezi, three centers. We've got Kabwe, under Kabwe, we've got Kabwe Secondary School. Lusaka, we've got Ibala High School. Kasama, we've got the Northern College of Education. 
Mansa, we've got the Mansa Trade School. Choma, we've got the Refreshing Ministry Center. Monze, we've got the Manungu Secondary School. Then the other centers, where we've got maybe one or two students, we cannot find a center for them, but they can come on live platforms always. But as we keep on recruiting, as the numbers grow, the centers will be confirmed and we will be able to go to those centers, those places which are, for example, in Dola. Dola, we haven't yet secured any center because we've got only about two, three students from Dola. So it's very, very difficult for us to get hold of the students, uh, the centers so that the students can go to. But however, we're trying to secure one just within the town center in Dola. And we shall be able to confirm in due course. For Lusaka, we've got less than less than 15 students. So we can't have so many centers in Lusaka. That's why we've got Rivala uh, High School. That's where all the students will go to. I hope I've made myself clear. And on that note, I'll end up here until we meet. What I'll just urge you is keep your eyes on the platform and every information shall be well communicated to you through the platform. If you've got any questions, raise it on the platform. Don't inbox me, don't call me, because it may be the same questions others want to know about. They want to get a clear understanding of whatever they say. Post your question on the platform so that I'll be able to answer once and for all, so that whatever you're going to hear from me will be the same communicated to everyone. Calling me directly, I may answer you in a different direction. The other one calls me on the same item and also tell him in a different story. So it will be very difficult and will be having a lot of answers on one person. So it's better you call on WhatsApp so that we'll be able to give you the same answer at the same time so that everyone is able to understand and digest whatever we are talking about. I thank you so much. And maybe let me ask you. SG at this moment to give us a closing prayer as we disperse. Okay, shall we pray? Am I audible? Yes, it's very clear. All right, let's pray. Our Lord and Heavenly Father, we are grateful for this wonderful day. We are grateful for the goodness that you have shown us and this path that you have brought us. You knew this time will come to pass, and so we are grateful even the more that it has come to pass. By your guiding spiritual wisdom and your faithfulness, we are here, O oh God, to say thank you for the proceedings. And Jehovah God Almighty, help us, O oh God, to understand each other more. And Jehovah, have clarity, O oh God, on what we are doing and what we are standing for. Jehovah, we are dealing with the needy. O oh God, I pray on behalf of Trikatane, needy and vulnerable. We ask you to help us, oh God, understand them more, oh God, with every need that they have. We pray that the teachers, oh God, come through according to the abilities that you have given them, those that have a passion, Jehovah, for the needy and the vulnerable, and that you sustain us according to your will. May you, Heavenly Father, be with us to the end of this day, oh God, by your grace, because you knew why you have woken us up, and it is your purpose that we are living for. May you guide us, protect us, and let the Holy Spirit, Jehovah, be the director of every step that we take because in your word so lord said you say oh god that you alone hold all things together and you are before all things so oh god we know that your eye is gazed upon us and you are aware of every situation that we have may you help us for we are eagerly waiting for you oh god to answer our prayers through any means and if trikatane is we are grateful and we ask you jehovah to lead us on in jesus mighty name we pray with a lot of thanksgiving in our hearts amen Amen. Thank you so much for being part of this program this today, which is the first day and two Friday. Thank you all. Thank you for this meeting. Bye-bye.